Hey guys, Slithering Serpents channel. It's Wednesday, November the 10th, around 1.30 in the afternoon, and this is where Butters has been hanging out since yesterday. Eating its uh, rat pup. It pretty much went in here and curled up, and this is where it's been since. And obviously, it's soaking up the heat, so. But I like that it's using this hide. It hasn't discovered yet. It was hanging out up here yesterday before I fed it and everything yesterday morning, but it hasn't figured out that there's a hole. It goes all the way down, you know. So, anyway. But, um... So, but... Butters is chilling out, and that's the name I named it. So... He's chilling out. Ink... Has not made an appearance for a week now. I'm quite sure she'll be out in the next day or two to shed her skin because I'm pretty certain this time around uh, she pulled this about a week back uh, from last week a week before that she pulled the same thing was gone for a week actually two weeks I should say she was AWOL and then showed up and that whole week I was looking for a shed and never saw one so I'm pretty sure this time around that's what she did uh, Blizzard, of course, is in blue. I did that video the other day. So Blizzard's in blue, so we know that. She's in her tub. And this is Butterscotch's digs here. And we're going to take a quick peek. Let me unlatch the back. So we're going to take a quick peek and see... What's up with butterscotch here? Because she ate. And actually, she is a female. Butterscotch is a confirmed female. Um, I saw that through a video. <clears throat> Pardon me. I saw that through a video. A girl over in Europe uh, did a video on sexing corn snakes. And um, that's what she showed in her video. And, okay, yep, there's butterscotch, all right. So, she's hiding out under her cork. Okay. So, I'll gently lay this back. I don't want to crush her. Okay. So, that's where she's hanging out at. All right, so that's where she's hiding out that, so. And like I said, she ate last week, so. I'm not in a big rush to feed her just yet. I want her to kind of chill out some more, you know. There's no reason to sit there and feed her. Or any of the snakes. There's no reason to feed them literally, you know, four days, five days, a week later after they ate. You know, there's no reason to sit there and overfeed them and stuff them with food the minute they are out and about again, you know. Um, it's always good to give them a little bit of a, you know, time in between meals, even if it's an extra week. Um, just because, you know. So they don't think that every time you reach in there to get them, that it's feeding time. So, anyway. But. But this is what I was saying. Yeah, you can see the hole goes all the way down, so. Because you can lay it sideways as well, but I like this one standing up better in this, in this tank, so. 
I will have to get another suction cup for this back side to kind of prop it up higher on the glass so that it doesn't, there's a risk of it getting into the uh, water bowl. But again, Butters is hiding out back in there, so it's kind of hard to see, but anyway. That's a little better. So, but I'm happy that uh, he ate, so that's the main thing. So, all right, guys, we're going to end this one right here, so. See ya.